All right, thanks so much, Justin. It's important to keep your kids off the so-called summer slide, and that's when they potentially lose what they've learned during the previous school year. And for the next few weeks, 13 Action News is sharing stories that will help your family stop that slide with summer rise and keep your kids' minds engaged over the summer. That's really important. And starting Monday, we're actually kicking off a big book drive, and we're going to have 30 drop-off locations. 13 Connect Summer Rise Community Campaign is sponsored by Subaru of Las Vegas and America First Credit Union. And one of our community partners is Spread the Word Nevada, and we're excited to have Lisa Habikhorst in the studio with us. She's the executive director of the organization. Welcome. Thank you. Glad well, to be here. Yeah, I love all the books. We always, Justin and I were looking going, oh, it's bringing us back to the old days. But um, listen, books are such a fun part of, I think, growing up and, and obviously learning to read. We get on our phones too much these days, don't we? Very much so. So obviously, <laughs> tell folks uh, just what your organization does. Well, we really focus on our at-risk kids. Mm -hmm. We're really trying to get equal opportunity for those kids who just don't have books in their home. They don't have the opportunity to be on a phone and those kinds of things, mm -hmm. and they have nothing. So what we, we want to do is get books into the hands of those children to give them an equal opportunity, and especially during the summer months because they're out of school. Right. There's not a lot going on in their worlds. So the more we can reach our kids and bring books into their homes so they have something to do mm -hmm. is a great thing. And so what, what are some of the things that you do through the year? Well, um, through the year we do, uh, we adopt schools that are low income mm -hmm. and we give books to children uh, they, to add to their home collection. They get one every month to build a home library. We also teach their parents the importance of reading together. We have activities with their parents and show them how to read because a lot of our parents, these parents didn't grow up with books in their home either, wow. nor parents who would spend that time with them. Mm -hmm. And then we also have a mentoring program where uh, volunteers can mentor with a struggling reader for an hour a week. And then this summer, what we're really working with the Summer Rise program is we have, um, we call it Books on Break. Mm -hmm. And so we're in 33 <laughs> sites across the city um, reading with these kids and bringing books and giving incentives for when they bring back reading logs that they've read all week. They come back in, bring the reading log, and then they get a little treasure box oh, prize. Perfect. So we're collecting that too. Oh. And um, it just kicked off this week. We've been um, already served 900 kids in the first three days. So mm -hmm. we really get to reach those kids. Yeah, it's kind of a fun summer thing to be able to pick out of the treasure box, right? Yeah. Be rewarded for all exactly. the reading that you've done. What's the reaction that you get from kids when they get a book? Oh, you would think that we were giving out uh, iPads. Really? You know, they, our kids are very, very excited to get these books. Oh. And they're smart enough to know, and especially at the young ages, mm -hmm. they don't really want the iPads. They right. want to hold a book. Yeah. I'm a person who holds a book, too. I love, I love reading like, a good book, yeah. Yeah, <laughs> and I love to turn the pages and know where I'm going. Right. So, um, yeah, the kids are very, very excited to get this opportunity. Okay, now where can people donate? What do we do to help out? Well, obviously the, we're having our book drive yes, and, <laughs> and you guys are our partner. Yes. And so any uh, drop off at any of those sites, but mm -hmm. all throughout the year, um, you can just call us up. We have uh, trucks on the road that will stop by your house and get books. Mm -hmm. You can come volunteer, get the books ready to go out to the kids um, and uh, we, or mentor a child. Yeah. So there's lots of different ways of getting involved with us. And we have about 5,000 volunteers who come through a year. Mm -hmm. So we definitely need the help. And I don't think people, I mean, I know that everyone realizes reading is a huge, uh, is very important, but how much we have to read just for, just to run our life. You know what I mean? Oh, yeah. And learning how to read and be a good reader, right. everything that we need to do from reading addresses to signing, you know, all right. that kind of thing. Um, it's so important to start at a young, at a young age, yeah. right? Yeah, we have to start that fire early mm -hmm. because we see that our 12 to 17 year olds aren't so much readers if they aren't when they're go beforehand mm -hmm. and they kind of lose that. Um, I, myself, mother of four, my last two are struggling readers. My boys just were not readers. Really? So some of the things I would do with them is read books that have movies made after them. And if we read the book, then we'll go see the movie and we'll, right. you know, anything to incentivize your kids to read, I'm all for it. That is a really, really good idea. I think yeah. we have your website too that has a bunch of different information and resources. And then on KTNV.com, we also have our website with the Summer Rise uh, list of uh, drop off locations and everything like that. So we're really kind of amping this up. We've been doing stories on home learning and how to use the library. That's awesome. And, uh, you know, working with the YMCA. So obviously, it's, it's something that we all need to keep top of mind. Thank you for being a community partner. Oh, you bet. And Thank you for letting us be part of this huge collaboration and leading the way. Yeah. Thank you very much. It's going to be great. The book drive starts Monday. We'll have more information on that all through next week as well. So thanks so much for joining us. You bet.